Wait, what? How did this happen? I am speechless. The lawyers would come after me so quickly. Also, Kenji, if you don't come in here right now, I swear to God. What the heck is going on? Hi, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of our Disney Legacy Challenge. We are back here with Tiana, Sydney, Austin, and Aurora in San Maishuno in their city townhouse, I guess. Tiana's trying to balance her work, her restaurant, her her YouTube career. We have Sydney here who is a gamer, streamer, slash full-time parent. Both of them um, are training the kids, working on their skills. So there's a lot going on here. So I really want to start setting some goals. Otherwise, I'm feeling like each gen is going to drag on <laughs> and I want to keep things interesting. So we're going to set ourselves some goals today of working on the skills of the kids and I guess Austin just aged up so we're gonna give him a little makeover now of clothes and stuff and Aurora is aging up in three days then I also want Tiana to go to the restaurant maybe once see if we can push that to a four and a half stars and then it would be really fun to just conclude everything maybe next episode with our five star and that basically is her gen wrapped oh I have a little muffin here. She's down on my lap, so if I'm distracted, I apologize. Okay, well, it's 9.30 on a Friday, so let's maybe do Austin while we're here. I'm gonna quickly jump into cast and change some of his outfits. <laughs> oh my God, I've just noticed that Austin is wearing these big old diamond earrings. You know what? I would keep them because he does look pretty cool, but doesn't quite match the fact that they are kind of struggling financially. So we're not gonna give him diamond earrings. And to be honest, in terms of clothes, I'm not that fussy. Like, I don't know if we really are gonna play Austin that much. So let's, I'll just give him some, some nice outfits. Okay, so let me show you what I've done for Austin. This is his everyday look. I've kind of gone with like a neutral beige color palette. So everyday, formal, athletic, Sleep. This is the party with <laughs> with the glasses. I think he looks really cool. Swimwear, hot weather, and cold weather. So yeah, that is Austin. Let's go do his bedroom now. Oh, everyone is going to bed. <laughs> they are so exhausted. It's been a long old day. If I remember correctly, today was the day that Cinderella died and then came alive again. So it was pretty eventful. Okay, so we have Austin's bed here, which we can delete. Aurora, she still got. She still got. Uh, three days, so let's leave her down there. Here, this is going to be Austin's room. So let's pull up some, it's kind of a shame that we have to do this separately to Aurora's. I love how Austin is actually gonna get the best room by far. And meanwhile, look at the parents' bedroom. They don't even have a wardrobe. Oh my God, that was all my money. The bed was all the money. Oh my God. That just jumped down from like 2000 to 996. Okay, so I guess we're not gonna really have a chance to do a full bedroom, but I just want some, maybe a zebra. Maybe make this a bit more neutral. No, I kind of like the red actually. It brings some color in here. Oh my God, this is gonna be tight. Well, we have, at least we have some royalties coming in in the next, how much is this? 850. We have royalties coming in in the next 10 hours or so. It comes in at 10 a.m. every day, I think. We're down to nine simoleons. All right, nine simoleons. See if we can survive the night on nine. I think we have enough meals in our fridge that we don't need to cook. Anything else that we might need over the night? Oh, I guess we can delete as we go. Oh, I do have something in my inventory. I have a Master Chef pot rack. And this was, I, I guess this was unlocked in uh, my culinary career. Ooh. Actually, having something hanging down there could be quite nice. What else? Let's delete this one because that one doesn't look good. This, do we have them that are slightly lower? Yeah, here. Oh, wait, I kind of like that. Yeah, okay, let's go with that for now. 59 simoleons. Oh God, it's really tight. Oh my God, we have three tombstones. You are joking. We have three tombstones and I believe they're all from, oh no, Zion. We have our dads. Never mind. Keep Zion's. Mm, these two here are <laughs> both people that have passed away in our restaurant. I feel mean selling them, but they're not really serving much purpose in my inventory. I'm sorry. We have a cake here, which I am going to put in my inventory or in the fridge so that we can use it for Aurora in a little bit. Okay, let's hang out with Austin for a little bit. Sydney and Austin discuss video games, watch Simder with Austin. They can hang out a little bit. Why is Austin crying? Loss in the family from losing a grandparent. It's hard to see those closest to us pass away. Grandparent? What? <gasps> Wait, what? 
how did this happen? I'm so confused because I swear we had one of these sentiments as something like saved my life, something like that. Wait, I'm so confused. Did I miss the notification? Did someone call me? Yeah, look, eight days ago, Cinderella has been brought back to life. Tiana's impassioned plea to the Grim Reaper must have worked. Can you see this? There you go. Sentiment gain. Am I still alive? Oh, I am. I guess you saved me. I am speechless. We need to, Tiana, you need to wake up and then let's travel to Cinderella's house. No! I don't understand. What was the point in saving Cinderella if she was gonna die literally within a couple of hours? Where does Cinderella live again? That's the White Household. Wait, wait, where did Cinderella move to? Did she move here? Oh my God, I'm literally so, so bad at this. Oh, she lived in Willow Creek. Uh, but now because Zion passed away and Cinderella's passed away, there's maybe no one in this house that we can, so we can get access to it. Oh my God, I'm literally devastated. I'm devastated. I'm absolutely devastated. Can we see it? Pause. Can we see something in urn in the entrance of the house? This is heartbreaking. How are you supposed to get like the belongings and stuff if you if you can't get access to it? How? Wait. Okay. Here's the thing. I would love it if there was a mod. Maybe there is already like an inheritance mod where if your parents pass away, you automatically get access to the house and everything inside of it, all the belongings, the funds, but also access to the tombstone. Okay, let's go back home. I don't think we're getting that urn, which is actually really heartbreaking. We might still get a phone call. Apparently with the Eco Lifestyle expansion pack, there is an inheritance system where your sim will get a random phone call when your parent passes away saying, do you want to accept the inheritance? You must get married within seven days to, to get, get access to it. So maybe we'll get that phone call. Anyway, that's really heartbreaking. Okay, let's go to bed. Oh my God, we just got sent to, oh my God, look at this. This. We just got sent two toys in the mail. I'm assuming because it was Austin's birthday. We have a little robot and we have Chompy the monster. Both are valued at like 200 simoleons each. So there is a lot of temptation to sell them, but I'm going to be a good mom and I'm not going to sell them. <sighs> so I don't know how productive this episode is going to be, but they're all really sad, but okay, let's, uh, let's send them all to bed. And then tomorrow, let's see if we can actually get them to the restaurant. Okay. It is now the morning. Tiana is going to make some breakfast for everyone. Uh, Aurora's already up. I think so is Austin. Yeah, Austin's awake, but I'm going to get him to do his homework. And it's the weekend. They don't have school, which is good, uh, but we will send Tiana to the restaurant around lunchtime, maybe. Oh, everyone's sad. Look at Sydney. They did actually have quite a close relationship. There was um, many nights where when Tiana was living in her apartment in San Moishuno, actually just across the street, remember Sydney would show up and then like five minutes later, um, Cinderella would show up. So all three of them would, they ordered pizza, they'd watch movies. It was actually really sweet. Let's get these two actually. I don't know if toddlers can, but let's get these two. Cheer themselves up a bit. A little bit of 8 a.m. basketball over here with Marion. Uh, meanwhile, I took Tiana here on a run. She is looking very stinky, so she's gonna go and have a shower. And Aurora here is being such a good girl. Look at her playing a game. <laughs> That's so cute. She's leveling up one of her skills. Okay, yeah, when Tiana cleans up and everything, then we'll give her, um, head her to the restaurant. I think actually before I go to the restaurant, I know I keep delaying, I always delay. I want to edit my, let's do the veggie chili recipe. Oh, oh my God, I just realized I actually locked the kids in the house. Oops, my bad. I locked the kids when they were toddlers in the house, so that's why he couldn't leave. Oh my God, we've just made more money. We finally got our royalties, 1,911. So that is probably enough to add a few more things to Austin's bedroom, but you know what? I think I'm gonna wait till we do Aurora's and then we'll do them both at the same time. Speaking of, we need her to hurry up and edit this video because I want to send her to the restaurant at 12. Look at these two playing together. Look, a little father-son Saturday day out. This is cute. I don't know who Marion is, but she's been she's been hanging out with us, but they're all just taking shots, playing basketball. Tiana here. Oh, maybe she's finished. It is already past 12. How is our video looking? It is great. Amazing. Let's upload quickly and then to the restaurant we go. Oh my God, look at the state of this restaurant after the crazy weather that we've had the last few times we've been here. There was a lightning strike here, lightning strike here, and clearly this chair was a victim of one of the lightning strikes. Replace for 350. 
no, sorry, not worth it. We also have loads of oil spills, which I don't know why we can, can't clean those up, but maybe they'll clean themselves up. Okay, let's open. Let's open the restaurant, change into our hostess outfit or maitre d' outfit. <gasps> oh my God. <gasps> not Sarah, not our host. The lawyers would come after me so quickly if that was real life. Oh my God, Sarah, I'm sorry. Okay, let's do some cleaning up, cleaning up. Soon we might be able to actually hire a performer to come and actually use that stage because at the moment the stage is useless. <laughs> Kenji, I thought we went through this. Okay, let's promote to chef level. F no, he's not worth. He's not worth it. He's like still giving me normal quality food, and he's hanging outside a lot. We can check up on and then praise, but I'm sorry, but you're not getting a you're not getting a pay rise. Ooh, okay, first customers coming in with a three. Let's do some greeting. What are you guys doing out here? What are they doing? Okay, we gotta pick up our trash. But what are they doing in the corner of my restaurant? Also, Kenji, if you don't come in here right now, I swear to God. Seriously, what? What? We, someone else is coming out here. And our waiters. What the heck is going on? Oh, okay, amazing. So uh, our waiter picked up the, the trash can, which is good. We don't need to do that. And our other waiters come out here. <laughs> what is going on? She's coming to tell them like, your food is ready, hurry up. I imagine that it's actually possible to go down in ratings and to go from a four to a three and a half. So I really, I can't have any threes. We really need fours and fives today. Is Daphne gonna get it or is she just gonna stand there and stare at it? I really feel like we're gonna need to fire Daphne. Pari here is just coming through every single time. Quality of the meal is excellent. We have excellent glasses of water and excellent caprese salad. Even her, like she's just also giving me attitude. I can look at the side eye. I can just tell that she's pissed off being here. Was that our friend in high school? Wait, do we know Sandra Scott? Let me check in our, oh my God, it is. It is, it is our friend from high school. Bless, and she's giving me a five star oh we have more people here we have Lori at a three star we can get that to a, f a four at least these two or these three actually have fours as well would love to get them to a five both of their food is excellent we're having so many excellent meals now <gasps> five this is like this is so exciting the restaurant was such a struggle for so long and we're just we're finally making progress and we're, do we're, we're doing it and it just feels so good Look, these are five stars as well. I wouldn't be surprised if we get a four and a half stars today. Honestly, we're we're so close. We're not getting a single four star review. They're all fives. Um, also, look who is sat with Lori. Ricardo, who I believe was also one of our high school friends. He was our, oh, he's married to Lori. He was actually, I think, a contender. It was Ricardo or Sydney or there was someone else, Kevin. Um, and I love that we're seeing all of our friends from high school. That's really cool. I'm gonna disallow new customers. Um, oh my God, we're, oh my God, there's so many people coming. <laughs> it's just really scaring me that there's a potential for the ratings to go down. But no, we're good. We're in a good flow. We have a lot of customers here though. So we gotta, gotta make, impress them. Molly takes her usual seat. She brings different people every time though, I love that. Amazing! We have a five over here as well. Okay, let's go downstairs. Let's work on the new the new um, tables. Can we have cleanup on floor two, please? We're making a lot of money today though. That, that, that sound has just been going off in my ear every few minutes. So many tables today. Oh my God, wait, no, never mind. Never mind, Daphne has beat me to it. Daphne is pulling her weight finally. She is, she's fixing her toilet. She did it. Good work, Daphne. Oh, okay, Molly left. I did not see what rating she did. These two here though are stuck on threes. Oh, please don't disappoint me. We're still at a four star down here, still at a four. Okay, we have excellent gnocchi and normal fish damn it okay but at least it's gone to a four. Oh, okay that's fine it's fine i wish i saw what molly gave us i'm a little gutted that this hasn't moved to a four and a half yet but maybe it still will upstairs is looking much better damn it it's a four it's all right it's fine it's good it's it's actually really good i got nothing to be worried about we are having 
solid four to five star reviews. We have 1,760. We can do, oh my God, we're so close to having a small ingredient discount. Literally 40 more points, which we can definitely do tomorrow. Okay, let's go home. I'm excited to come back to the restaurant. Probably we'll just come back tomorrow again. Sydney, how you been? How you been, Sydney? What have you been up to today? Played some basketball. You worked on some family, family stuff. Aw, they're all having a little family meal. They've all had dinner. I am sending everyone to bed now. Tomorrow is also Sunday, so we don't have to send anyone to school or work, which is nice, apart from Tiana, who will be going to the restaurant. You know what I realized? We haven't had to pay bills yet, which is good, but I'm... Oh my God, I knew it. That's over an entire day of royalties. No. Oh God, that sucks. We're gonna need more money. We're not earning enough as a pro gamer. I'm gonna have Sydney wake up and get a new job. <laughs> I am because it's just, this is not gonna work for us. We're gonna need Sydney to earn a little bit more money. Financially, it's just not viable anymore. Oh, he's already up. He already, and he's on, is that Twitch? Oh my God, I never knew that they had Twitch. That is so cool. Is he watching Twitch or is he playing, watching gaming streams on Sims.tv? That is so freaking cool. Okay, that's, that's awesome. Well played Sims, well played. Okay, let's career, let's quit job. We're gonna need something a lot more well-paying. Let's have a think. Do we want to, do we want Sydney to be a good person? <laughs> I was thinking kleptomania, quit. But I mean, obviously that's not a job. It's just a way that would allow us to, to stay home and make money when we have time. You make a lot of money. Oh, this is tough. Muffin, what do you think? We just need money. That's, frankly, that's it. Highest paid Sims jobs. 13 highest paid careers in The Sims. All right, that's what we like. The, that's exactly what Sydney would be Googling right now. Number 13, scientist, 12, space ranger, 11, management, boss, criminal. Number two is a stylist, style influencer. And number one is an officer in military. The career currently has the highest sal salary among all other careers. It has two branches. Both branches have the same salary. Simmons work for eight hours, five days a week. Oh my God, in both branches, players get 422 simoleons per hour. <gasps> Oh my god, amazing. Oh my god, wait, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. That sounds perfect. That's exactly what we want. Officer military. Done. Amazing! Well, that was a bit of a change in careers. <laughs> Monday at 6 a.m. Work assignment. Should Sydney get a jump start and accept the assignment? Yes. Sydney, go for a run at 5 a.m. Nice little morning jog. Sydney's good to go. Reach level two fitness. I think we have a level yeah, we have a little level five. Um have a little shower. I feel better about this. It's not like the perfect career for Sydney, but we never really, well, me personally, I never got really emotionally connected to Sydney. It's just kind of convenient because we met him at university. Um, no offense, Sydney, you've been great. <laughs> you've been a great dad. But yeah, we never really like emotionally connected to him. So I didn't give him a full personality in the way I probably should have. I'm also gonna sell these toys because these kids have not touched these toys at all. <gasps> Oh my God, this is such a sad episode. Hi, Tan, I'm calling you to let you know that your family member, Dopey White, has passed away. I'm sorry for your loss. These Sims are just gonna be sad for the rest of their life. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. Well, on the plus side, we just got more royalties. We're now at 4,782, which means we're good to pay the bills, but we still barely have enough to do any kind of decent decoration to this upstairs. Who's calling? Oh my God. Are you serious? Hi, Tiana, I'm calling you to let you know that your family member, Bashful White, has passed away. I'm sorry for your loss. They literally passed away within like 30 seconds of each other. Do not, do not pick up the phone. I don't wanna get any more phone calls. All right, we are opening the restaurant. I'm excited slash nervous. It's always, it's kind of nerve wracking now. I don't know why. The pressure just to get the five stars feels so much more intense now that like everything is going for the restaurant. Everything is working. Now it's just on me and Tiana. Let me guess. <laughs> Let me guess, Kenji is still standing outside. Same old, same old. At least he's smiling, bringing good vibes and positivity. <gasps> what the heck is going on? What? Hi, Sydney. I'm calling to let you know that Marcel Price has passed away. Three deaths? in five minutes. Oh my God, this game is so intense. This Everything just comes at once. Like there's just, 
It is 150% always. That's crazy. Okay, Marcel Price, I guess, was Sydney's brother, I think. Or no, maybe Sydney's. No, it can't be Sydney's dad. Or I guess it could be. Could be Sydney's dad. Okay, okay. Tiana, come on. Time to welcome. Welcome. Oh, we already have a four before you've even arrived, Floyd. There's so many people here, and they just all come at the same time. Wait, do we not. Oh my god, Kenji. I was gonna say, the chef is not even chefing right now. There, yeah, there's- everyone arrives at the same time. It's very stressful. Oh, oh my god, wait, wait, let's- let's do our perk points. Perk points! Yes! Okay, so we have the ingredients discount. Permanently lowers the cost of ingredients, 1,800. Purchase. Done. Amazing. Okay, that should take effect today. Oh god. Oh my god. And right in the entrance. <laughs> okay, we have one five star, but there's so many threes. Oh no, those people left with threes. Okay, we have two fives here. Excellent and normal. The gumbo is still normal quality. Not great. God, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm so nervous. This is just like really stressful. A lot of people have left. 221. Oh god, look at these. Both of them have threes. Why is today going worse than yesterday? Like what has changed? <gasps> yes, four stars and they haven't even got their food yet. Or let's let's seal the deal on a five. Yes, oh my God. Okay, how are we doing for stars? We are at a four and a half stars. Okay, so let's see if the, well, we don't actually know if the cost of ingredients has gone down. It was kind of the same actually. And we did make about 500 yesterday as well. So it doesn't look like it's made a huge difference. Um, Daphne is still showing unsatisfied. At least Pari is now neutral because she got a pay rise. Sarah needs a pay rise next. Okay, I think this is where we're gonna end today's episode. I'm so, so freaking happy with how everything is going. We now will have enough money after the next round of royalties to give bedro the bedrooms a makeover. In fact, give the entire upstairs a makeover and wrap up our gen three with the five-star restaurant hopefully so thank you so much for watching as always and i will see you all in the next episode bye, bye.